Welcome to Fire Engineering Training Minutes. I'm Frank Ritchie, and today I'm here in New Haven with Colin Whalen, assigned to Rescue Company One. Colin and I are gonna show you and demonstrate the right way and the wrong way to take out HUD windows. Colin, can you explain the construction of these windows? So the construction of a HUD window begins with the plywood board on the exterior, which covers the whole opening uh, for protection or to prevent access onto the inside. Uh, connecting the plywood board is the two carriage bolts with a 2x4 in the inside running the length of the window. In some cases you might find multiple uh, levels of 2x4s, uh, one being high and one being low. Uh, going into um, defeating this, you would want to start with the top one first, letting the smoke and heat out and then working into the bottom layer of the HUD window. Now you don't just find these in high security air areas. You can also find these in situations where you have storms, hurricanes. The advantage of setting up a HUD window for individuals and occupants is they don't have to drill into the side of the frame. It's just simply a compression of the two by four holding the plywood in place. Let's take a look at the best way to attack these bars. Okay, they're gonna attack the carriage bolt by putting the pike of the halligan above the carriage bolt and driving it through to create relief. Okay, once he has the relief, he's gonna take the ax and just hit the carriage bolt up a little. All right, once it's up, he's gonna attack with a sensible level of aggression. Now note, if the bars are only held on, by one bar instead of two. Once you take one, the whole panel may fall out. Go ahead. Okay, go to the next one. Okay, he's banging up the carriage bolt, perfect. Drive it right through. and we're in. You could see here how it was held up with the compression on the window. Often firefighters will find this HUD construction and just try to pry it off and the HUD construction will beat them. Help him out, Nate. One of the problems with doing this the wrong way is when they get the gap off the bottom, if you have fire, heat, and smoke on the inside, now it's coming out in the firefighter's face. What you saw here is very interesting. Note, they didn't beat the HUD windows, they beat the actual frame of the building. Today, we showed you the right and wrong way of defeating a HUD window. Thanks for watching Training Minutes from Fire Engineering. Get out and train. <laughs>